Good evening and happy Friday everyone. As harvest season is in full swing, the North Dakota Department of Agriculture says the majority of crops this year are either in fair or poor condition. Valley News Live's Alex Larson spoke with one farmer to see how the ongoing drought is impacting the harvest. Hillsboro farmer John Birch says he started harvesting soybeans but has not yet started on corn. I have heard of other people in the area that have harvested corn. Um, that one seems to be taking a, a pretty big hit. Uh, that one more uh, wants more moisture in a timely fashion than say a soybean. So uh, they have seen a hit I've heard there um, in regards to yield. You look at like in our area around that 130-ish area, which is, which is low. Some farmers have also reported smaller soybeans this year. And that of course adds up to your bushels and then also test weight. Test weight has been a little bit on the lighter side and smaller beans. And the whole problem is, is that we didn't get moisture to fill the pods. And so the beans didn't fill out and especially the top pods on the plant did not fill out. So that is what we're seeing. Sugar beet harvest starts October 1st, but with temperatures predicted to be in the 70s next week, farmers could potentially run into some problems. When we're this hot now for this long, sugar beet guys need it cooler because they will not take the sugar beets at the factory because they can't keep sugar beets at that high of a temperature. They want to get them out of the ground, but they will not allow them to get them out of the ground if it's 70 degrees or above. The problem for next year will be if the conditions are similar to 2021. Used up quite a bit of subsoil moisture right now. So if we go into next year without some good snow cover uh, and without some timely rains next year, uh, next year will be tough. Birch says so far this year, the weather has been cooperative for harvest. In Hillsboro, Alex Larson, Valley News Live. Now, according to the National Drought Database, this, this is the seventh driest year in the last 127 years for North Dakota.